hello everyone welcome back to another video my name is camera i'm unique don't forget to like comment and subscribe today we are getting into my skincare routine it's been a long time coming because it always wasn't like this girl curated a regimen that works for me a couple weeks ago i was suffering from contact dermatitis girl i don't know what happened to my skin but for a while there was a group of bumps in my lower jaw area that would not go away i went to an esthetician and everything but i knew after that visit my treatment wasn't gonna stop there so i had to take matters into my own hands my skin now looking like glass so this is what i use to clear up my dermatitis fade hyperpigmentation that it left behind and also helps with acne so let's get into it <laughs> We're just gonna hop right into it and before i even get started into my cleansing routine i have to wear these water resistant wristbands I hate when water runs down my arm i'm gonna go in with the salawusu gentle cleansing oil i love this cleanser i double cleanse and it's oil based because i have oily skin so it helps control my oils and also it helps prepare me for my actual cleanse and also when i have makeup on this takes it off so effortlessly if you aren't double cleansing you're missing out. Normally, to take this off, I just use a towelette and I just damp it and then I just wipe my face off. These next two products are major key when it comes to my skincare. Pan Oxo mixed with Dial Antibacterial Soap. You heard me. Antibacterial soap, the soap that's in this bathroom and the public bathroom. My mom was actually the one that told me to use Dial Soap and kid y'all not, the contact dermatitis cleared up within a week. I swear to you, including other acne pimples that were on my face. Because if you really think about it, acne is really just bacteria. That's why I love Pan Oxo because it attacks the bacteria on your skin. And then in combination with the Dial Soap, you're going to have glass skin. Don't ever say I never put you on. And when you apply these two cleansers, Cleansers, apply them to your face without water and let it sit for about 30 seconds and then go in with the water to activate the cleansers. You can get the most out of the product and it can work properly. And I like to go in with my Foreo Luna cleansing device. I love this because I really feel like it's cleansing my face and getting that cleanser all in my pores. And I love that this is silicone so it doesn't have bacteria build up on the device. I always use a disposable towelette to dry off my face after cleansing just because I don't like the bacteria that a towel could hold and it can get on my face. And also the little lint from the towelette can get on my face. So I just like using reusable towel. I like to exfoliate my face at least once a week. And this is my favorite exfoliant. This is the triple acid exfoliating peel solution by Shiny Darden. Oh my God, every time I use this peel, my skin looks impeccable and if you don't want to get this exfoliant i highly encourage you to grab the dr dennis gross peel pads if you're somebody who's suffering from acne and really trying to bounce back your skin if you haven't heard about these you're gonna hear about them now okay these have transformed my skin and this is gentle enough for me to use every single day as an exfoliant but i have alternated from using these every single day to using these at least once or twice a week because my face isn't as bad as it was also the peel pads do come in different strength levels so if you're somebody who has sensitive skin i believe they have a sensitive daily peel for you to try out but yes you should be exfoliating your skin at least once or twice a week so I'm just applying the shiny Darden peel and I like to apply this so thin because it does sting a little bit and then I go ahead and apply the neutralizer. I let that sit for like a minute, not even like 30 seconds. It The instructions say don't even leave it on for a minute. 
So this peel has lactic and mandelic acid, which helps exfoliate and brighten your skin. And it also has glycolic acid in here. So it's going to help really clean out your pores. And it also has a clay inside the mask in the ingredients to help control your oils without over drying. And every time I take this mask off, I see such a huge difference. Um, and fun fact, Kelly Rowland uses this mask as well. So if you want to have that youthful, glowy look, here you go. <laughs> So next, this step would have been optional since I exfoliated, but we obviously removed the peel. So I'm going to reapply some more glycolic acid. And glycolic acid is so beneficial when it comes to brightening the skin and just really exfoliating to reduce fine lines and wrinkles, fight acne, fade hyperpigmentation. And this one specifically I love because it has aloe in it. Um, and it doesn't dry out my skin. It hydrates my skin. And I just really love how this makes my skin look. So next we're going to get into serums and this first serum I like to apply is the Lancome HCF serum. It's a triple serum. It has hyaluronic acid, niacinamide, and a form of vitamin C and ferulic acid. And what I like about this serum is that it really keeps my skin super plump. And I like to go in with my MidiCube. Y'all, this is a game changer for me. This does its help maximizes skin absorption. So basically it's going to push the product deep into your pores and you're going to get the best out of your products. Don't ever say I never put you on. This is so worth it. And honestly, I really enjoy applying my serums with this. And this does vibrate and it does have up to five levels. I've really been enjoying this Dr. Dennis Gross Fill and Repair Serum. So this is going to help with elasticity, girl. So we don't have fine lines and wrinkles. And I love that this has hyaluronic acid in here. So it's going to give hydration to the skin. And I've also been applying this on my neck. And I've seen such a huge difference. And yeah, I'm just, you know. I've been including anti-aging products because wrinkles wear. Please, we got to be prepared. <music> So we're going to be going in with the Nabuzin Serum. This is a collagen pudding, number four. This is Japanese skincare I got from Amazon Girl. I'm running low, as y'all can see, but I love this. As y'all know, collagen is good for plumping the skin. So again, another anti-aging product that I've been enjoying. So I just apply this on my face and also my neck. Also, I do like to work this under my eyes as well because as y'all know, fine lines and wrinkles start there because that's like the thinnest area on the face. And I don't use an eye serum right now so i just really want that collagen to really go in on my under eyes this will be the time where i would spot treat i love to do a spot treatment with the 10 percent benzoyl peroxide up and up target brand hello and i had a pimple so i applied it on my lower jaw yeah i love this this literally clears my pimple up every time i have one so for moisturizer i've been using the snail 92 all-in-one cream as y'all know the snail mucin is chef's kiss for the skin especially when repairing your skin barrier the skin is glowing every time i apply this my skin looks like glass make sure you go grab this cream and then next i like to go in with vitamin c and i like to mix this with my fortuna skin i have oily skin so i love to use the oil to lock everything in and this one is so good i love it so much this is my second bottle if you've been struggling to get moisture back into your skin highly suggest this and also repairing your skin barrier and also it helps just keep my skin super plump and youthful looking and helps me maintain my oils because i do have oily skin and the reason I do this is because I'm telling my skin I'm getting enough moisture. So you don't need to be acting up and creating more oil. Okay, you would think oil on oil will make your skin oily. No, it doesn't. It will control the sebum on your skin. <music> Last but not least, we are going to be applying SPF always. If you aren't using SPF, girl, what are you doing? I go in with the Shiseido 50 Plus, and I've been really rocking with this sunscreen. I also bounce between the La Roche-Posay 60 
SPF for the face, ultra light. I bounce back between the two, definitely top two. And then I mix it in with the de-bronzing drops from Drunk Elephant. I just really like that little tint, especially if I'm not applying any makeup. I just like mixing the two and it just gives me an effortless, flawless, glowy, youthful skin, glass skin look. <music> Summer Fridays has me in a choco, baby. I love the Pink Sugar Summer Fridays lip gloss. It's so good, hydrating to the skin, and makes my lips super juicy and hydrated. The skin is giving glass. These are the products that I've been using for the last couple weeks to really heal my contact dermatitis and also get rid of acne, and I've been rocking with it. So the supplements that I've been taking that I've noticed such a huge difference when it comes to my skin is black seed. Black seed helps with inflammation, and what is acne? Inflammation on the face. I take these every single day. I take two. Also, I take Hum Daily Cleanse Vitamins every single day. This is actually good for your skin. This helps detox your skin and impurities from within and it has green algae so basically it's going to help your digestive functions detoxify whatever is going on internally to help clear your skin you've been here for a while you see me talk about these numerous of times so that is it for this video i hope you guys enjoyed let me know down in the comments what you'll be adding to your skincare routine i hope you take something from this video because everybody deserves to have glass skin so i love you all so much and i'll see you all next video